Every year, the San Diego Humane Society typically sees about 100 baby raccoons brought in by volunteers. Caretakers look after them for about six months until they're ready to be released back into the wild. News 8's Brian White paid a visit to their new nursery in Ramona and shows us all kinds of footage of these adorable animals. Yes, I'm at the new raccoon facility at the Humane Society's Ramona campus, and they have over 50 raccoons right now, and let me tell you, they're taking great care of these animals. Video of eight raccoons released back into the wild a few weeks ago near Lake Henshaw. This is very, very rewarding work. The Humane Society typically rescues about 100 baby raccoons a year, and so far this year, they're up to 60. They're curious about everything. They're just always exploring, always looking for new things. The Humane Society's Project Wildlife has taken care of rescued raccoons for decades, but it's always been handled at multiple locations across the county. This is actually the first year where they set up a centralized raccoon nursery at the Ramona campus. We've taken all these pre-release enclosures down that were at at our satellite care facilities and brought here. When they're brought in, baby raccoons will first be cared for in the nursery and they're treated to all kinds of good food. This is a meal for a group of eight raccoons. The caretakers work hard to make these little ones happy and sometimes they can't help but to take a moment and just watch them. I think every day we lose track of time when we're taking care of them watching them discover new things. Once big enough, they'll graduate to the outdoor pre-release enclosures where they're one step closer to being back in the wild. Really, that's where they learn to be a raccoon and learn to, to hunt. Uh, they need to be able to live hunt. They need to they catch bugs. Obviously, caretakers develop a sentimental connection with these animals, but ultimately, they all know that it's best for them to return to the wild. You can see it's easy to get attached to these little guys when they're in the nursery, but everybody knows the best case scenario is to release them back into the wild. In Ramona, Brian White for News 8.